Hey guys, Austin here with Carlson Cards, back with another PSA reveal video. So as you can see, we have 20 cards in front of us. Um, today, I did want to mention, I got an email from PSA with this order. They basically said, hey, uh, you have a card that's worth a lot more than what's allowable for this service level. I sent these at $50, which allows up to $1,000 in value of the card. Um, and I got charged $150. So you can imagine there's a card in here that's absolutely huge. The fun part is, guys, I don't know which one it is. I have a few that it could be, you know, a few that could, if they get 10s, be around that price range, um, you know, but we're going to see. It's going to be fun. Uh, so one difference also with today as we get started here, I did just take the cards in the order they came in. Normally I sorted them, you know, on the back so I didn't see the grades, but I sorted them back in the order I sent them in. Uh, but this time I just want to keep them in the order that I got them in to kind of, you know, maybe cause a little more chaos and have it be more fun for all of us, so... All right, let's go ahead and get started. So first and foremost, I did not get graded on this 2002 Topps Chrome Tom Brady. Um, it got min size, which just meant it was probably trimmed or came out of the factory, kind of, um, you know, not the same size as what it should have been. So this I didn't get charged for, which is nice. They don't charge you when this happens, but um, so that's okay. So this, I have a 2006 Bowman Chrome Blue Refractor Tom Brady. Um, and today I did want to mention my pre-grade. So for this one, I had it as an eight. Um, it had some, you know, minor surface issues in the front here. Um, so we'll see how we do. Pulled a nine. Okay, awesome, nice. That's how I want to share grades, guys, because a nine here, you know, normally I might, you know, not be crazy excited, but this is a, I think, a pretty huge card, um, and one that I don't have yet. It's out of 150, so I'll keep this one in the collection. Awesome. We'll go ahead and keep going here. Next up, 2005 Topps Chrome or 2008, sorry, X Fractor Tom Brady. Uh, so this one did have surface scratches. I kind of penned it as an eight um, with possible nine, but I'm assuming an eight. Pulled a nine. Okay, <laughs> nice, nice. Okay. This is good, guys. So far, good. So far, so good. Um, I know that, you know, a lot of the cards in this order, they were older, like typical for me. So I never, you know, it's hard to assume a 10, um, but you can get them on occasion. Uh, so this one's off-centered and it does have a print line. Um, so I thought an eight or a nine, probably a nine. Um, did pull a nine. Okay, nice little start here. Three nines, that's good. Next, we have a, another 2008. This is the Copper Refractor. So guys, this one's really, really good looking. Um, I didn't find a ton on it. I really thought it had an outside shot at a 10. Um, so to me, this maybe is one I could have gotten upcharged on, but we'll see. It's probably a nine, but uh, <laughs> we'll check. Pull it a nine. Okay, still not bad, guys. Uh, so these are out of 425. Cool looking card. Um, the reason I said it was probably a nine, because I think if I got a 10 on that one, I would have been upcharged, but I don't think it would have quite been $150. All right, so this one, super, super excited about. This is the Aaron Rodgers Crystal Atomic Refractor 2011 Topps Chrome. So if you're familiar with this set, this is the only year they did these crystal refractors. Um, and this card looked absolutely beautiful. Bought it at a local card show. Oh, let's see. Pulled a nine. Damn. Okay. Darn it. That's all right. Totally fine there. I uh, did pull a nine on it. But, you know, any of these that had an outside, outside shot as a 10, um, you know, you always hope for a 10, but it's not, you know, not guaranteed. Next, we have a Russell Wilson. This is the Topps um, Platinum Orange Refractor. This one I assumed a nine, had some surface issues. Uh, pulled a nine. Wow, this is a lot of nines so far, guys. Let's make it up for it. Hopefully, we can get a few tens at this in this order. I know I have one, right? Um, so we'll see. So, top 2008 Bowman Chrome Blue Refractor, Tom Brady. Uh, it's kind of similar to that 2006 we had shown. I do have a copy of this in a nine. So, um, you know, if I get a nine, I'll probably sell it. If I get a 10, I'll upgrade my collection. Pulled a nine, and that's actually, wow, that is a, looking at my notes here, that's a huge grade on this one. So I got a nine. Um, I'll show you this corner. I thought it was a seven or eight because of that corner. It's maybe a little tough to see, but the film is coming off and, um, you know, off center pretty bad in the back. But this goes to show you guys, I want to share the pre-grades just so you're aware um, of what I'm looking at. And, you know, a nine here is a stellar, stellar grade. That's as good as getting a 10 for how the quality is. All right, so next we have a Peyton Manning. This is 2002 Topps Chrome or Topps Racine Refractor. I've done well on these. I hope this is our first 10. We'll see. Yes, okay. I was going to say, we'll see, but I'm flipping it right there. So that's a 10. I'm happy about this one. So I didn't have a 10 currently in my collection. I had an 8, um, but I'll be keeping that one for sure. That's really, really nice looking card. All right, next we have a Topps Finest Larry Fitzgerald Rookie Card Refractor. Um, you know, this one I thought, I pegged it kind of as an 8. It had scratches. I think the back had a dimple too. Um... Pulled an eight, okay. Not too fun down there, is it? No. You see, your actions have consequences. It's that one I was finally right on. Like I said, I probably undergrade a lot of these. I kind of assume eights or nines and they end up higher, but this one I thought deserved an eight and I did put that, so. All right, so here we have a 2004 Topps Chrome Refractor Tom Brady. Um, this one's off center, left to right. 
had some surface issues, so I pegged it as kind of, I would say, again, eight or nine range. Pulled a nine, nice, wow. So I'm flipping the coin in the right way on a lot of these guys. Like I said, just the off-centeredness, you know, should default it to a nine. And then I had surface scratches, so I kind of assume it knocks it down, but this goes to show you it's it's not, you know, um, if you have a decent grader, the nines are not terribly hard to come by, the, but the tens are very hard with these type of cards. Next, we have a 2003 Dwayne Wade first edition. A um, little off-centered. Surface wasn't the best, so I did think this was probably a nine. Pulled a nine. Okay, not bad. Our nine pile is massive right now. That's that's all right, though. Like I said, a lot of these I thought were worse. Next, we have a 2003 Topps Chrome Peyton Manning. This is a black refractor, so a little off-centered. Surface wasn't the greatest. Um, probably another nine, and it is. Still a really cool card there, guys. That's a sweet-looking card. Nice Peyton. So this will go in the collection, too. I don't have one currently. And guys, just want to mention, if you haven't subscribed, you know, please do feel free. I know a lot of you watching are not yet subscribed, but I come out with these every week. Um, so stay tuned. I have some absolutely ridiculous orders. Next week, um, I had a $300 upcharge. So that's implying the card's close to 5000 value. So we'll have to wait and see what one that is. All right, here's 2000 Topps Chrome Paint Manning Refractor. Um, again, pegged it as a nine, so it's probably nine. Another nine. All right, next we have a 2005, just the base tops chrome. I only send these if I think they're 10. Looking at it now, maybe a little off center, so it's probably a nine. Uh, pulled a 10, okay, nice. Nice little win there. Um, these as nines, you know, you lose probably 20 bucks, but on, on a 10, you make fairly significant money, so it's usually worth it if I get them in clean. 2004, this is just the base tops chrome. Uh, probably a nine, you know, these are gonna be tough gems, but I thought I had an outside shot at a 10. Um, pulled a nine. All right, next we have a 2003 Gold Refractor Peyton Manning. So this one, die cut edges, you know, this one especially, I, I noticed there's some fraying on the edges, so it's probably an eight is what I had thought. I did pull a nine on this, which is a stellar grade, so that's in my collection currently. And this one is a PSA eight. Okay, <laughs> so second so far. But again, I mean, I think fair grader. I would have hoped to have pulled maybe a few more tens in here, but this is fine so far. Um, still have not seen the upcharge, but um, you know, I'm, I'm seeing a card there that it could be, so we're going to see here. So this is a 2006 Topps Chrome Aaron Rodgers Refractor. A uh, little off-centered, but overall, decent card. I, I usually, again, send these if I think it has an outside shot at a 10. Pulled a 9. Not bad, but um, again, he'd wish he got a 10. All right, so here we go. This is uh, this is a really nice card. So 2001 Topps Chrome, sorry, UD uh, Rookie FX Tom Brady. So in 2001, he had a few cards. This was still before he had really played, so it wasn't in a lot of sets. I couldn't find an issue on this card. I really, really thought it was a 10. And so when I got the upcharge email, guys, like, you know, I was pretty sure it was this card because out of the rest of these, I didn't think much had a shot at a 10. This is kind of a, you know, filler order, just cards I had kind of ready to go, but um, didn't think were crazy. So this one, you know, we'll see. Pull the 10, awesome. So this is, again, what I expected was the upcharge, and this is just a gorgeous card, guys. So this sits right now at about $2,500 in value. I think, you know, usually I don't share values of what I paid just because I don't, that's not what I'm about. You know, I'm kind of growing a collection through grading, and that's what this is about for me. Um, but this one I just want to share, I did pay about 300 for. So you can imagine this is a hit I'm stellar with. I told my wife I got an upcharge, you know, she was pretty excited too. We took a uh, dinner date, you know, whenever you get those upcharges, you know, you made pretty substantial money or you, you upgraded the value of a card. So it's always really nice. All right. So we ended up, ended up here with a black refractor, Aaron Rodgers, nice looking card. I um, thought I had a shot at 10, but you know, probably again, a nine based on how this grader has been uh, ended with a nine. Okay. Not bad overall guys. So good order. Again, I will throw a recap if you stick around right here. Um, and then, you know, beside that, I'll look forward to seeing you guys next week. So thanks for joining.